Hello and welcome to Contractor's Point of View. My name is Gary and sometimes you want to venture out and try something new. Well, I thought I would give this uh, snail case a try and so I wanted to do a little video for you guys and show putting it on, taking it off, and also giving you my first impressions of the case. So let's just jump right into this and take this on. All right, to start with, I picked up two cases. I got the gray iridium and the red and black. Uh, the packaging looks pretty nice. Uh, this company is out of uh, Dallas-Fort Worth, Texas. The product is made in China and it's got a very patriotic packaging. So let's start with the gray iridium. Iridium, whatever you want to call it. Uh, so big chunk of styrofoam. Uh, looks like card. Whoa, instructions and a handwritten letter. All right, so we're not really concerned with that right now. It's a two-part case. There's the front. All right, so you come with uh, some protective film on that puppy. So let's get rid of that. So this thick, this is pretty thick plastic here on the back. Uh, and then you've got a rubberized, oh, I like the buttons a lot. They stick out pretty good. Let's see what they look like on the phone. All right, we'll go through this real quick. Uh, this is gonna be the bottom. Stick this on here. Hopefully we can get this on and off pretty painlessly. Cause I'd like to have another case to use on the weekends. I use my rugged case during a work, work week. All right, so let's see. I know you're supposed to start at the bottom and get it worked on that direction. Wow, it's very stiff. It's probably because it's very new. So let's go see if we can get this puppy on. Gotta get the buttons back in the hole. I think I did that wrong. I have to peel that off, get it in there a different way. Yep, you're witnessing first time struggle, so if this is you, you can expect to either do better than me or not. I don't know. I've been I put on a lot of cases, so didn't expect to have any struggles here. All right. So getting this wrapped around, everything looks good. All right, there we go. Let me wipe it down real quick. Get rid of the fingerprints. All right, look at that. Iridium with the gray. I kind of like the gray around the front and the buttons do stick out really well. All your ports are accessible. Uh, there is no flaps covering these, but you can still get to your S Pen. No problem. That works out fine. And there you go. So that's case number one. What do you think? Feels pretty good. Feels pretty solid. It was tight going on. It was really tight going on. So saw me struggling. All right, so that's it. That's case number one. Okay, let's uh, see how easy it comes off. Typically, you look for that little notch right there. Make sure you can see it on the camera. You peel that corner off, you peel that corner off, and then you kind of open her up. There you go. So that's case number one. The iridium with the gray. I think I'm saying that right. Gray, oh, iridescent. Yeah, see how all right, so great iridescent. All right, phone's back. We'll leave this one off to the side. Let's get into this guy. See if maybe they're all that tight. 
because that was a tight case. That ain't gonna come off, that's for sure. All the same packaging, get that out of the way. So this one's black with red. So let's peel that off and peel this off. So having a two part case instead of one part case is gonna give you more protection obviously. So let's stick this on here. And I guess, if you really wanted to, you could use this face with this case, or this face with this case, because they should be identical. But we'll just put them on with the ones they go with and start with there. Okay, let's go. Let's see if we can get this on a little better than the last one. Start at the bottom, work your way up. Yeah, it's working better. Let's see if we can get this side on. It's still tight, which is a good sign. It's not gonna fall off. It's not gonna give your room, phone room to wiggle. Sorry, I keep bumping the camera. Struggles of a phone case. Install. Ooh, yeah, that went a lot better. Um, it's definitely tight, but I think it's meant to be like that. So, there you go, let's rub this one down with a little cloth. Get the fingerprints to go away. I'm sorry if my hands look shredded, I've been working wiring panels. So that's the front, looks real clean. All black and then the back with a little bit of red and the white. And the buttons on this, like I said, buttons stick out real well. Push the power button, came on, no problem. Screen's fully protected. I don't know if you'll be able to see, but it does have raised edges on the top and the bottom. And then so that protects the phone when it falls on its face. So, nice and clean. You can still see the color of your phone and back. If you have the uh, Aurora Glow phone, it's gonna look really good, especially with the uh, iridescent case that's so funny I said it wrong I said it wrong uh, anyway well you got it right now so anyway this is the red and you're good to go no problem so seems like it's pretty good a little tough to put on but nothing you can't figure out and that again is Snail case. Let's see if I can get that in the light right for you. Ooh, boom, there you go. All right. Galaxy Note 10 Plus snail case. Give these a try on my weekend days when I don't need my holster. Um, you guys might want to check them out. If there's any questions, comments, please leave them down in the comment section below. I'll put links for these in the description. I picked them up off of Amazon. These were not provided for me. Uh, they are seeing this video same time as you are. Until next time, stay safe.